getting stuck. It's stuck real good. Is it? Go, don't go. Dale. No, no, don't break the window cover. No, no, no. Somebody installed the power windows, but fudged it all up, like everything else. I don't know why I get stuck. I don't know if it's the motor. The window, the glass looks fine. That worked. Now it goes. Push it this way. Yeah. It's not centered, right? Here we go again. Here we go again. Here we go. Or at least it goes up and down. We need to hook up the switch so we'll be able to go up and down. It's a switch. This is it. No, mames. That's the switch. We got to take it off to see how it works. Give me Phillips. Got to put that. This is the pop doors right here. No wiring for the pop doors. Looks like it's not strong enough look, to move the the original latches. They're pretty strong. Right. Yeah. yeah it's so it's meant to be cranked. Yeah. You're supposed to put like a bear claw latches, something that's a little bit softer. And then they figured out it didn't work. See. I can guarantee you if we disconnect this, this, it'll probably move it, but let's see what we're gonna do first. Let's see what a... Okay, so I look good. It's already grounded, but they flipped it. I don't get it, dude. They put the ground over the motor, around the motor to this little, like, what is this, like a house screw or something? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Pinche carapilla, did you and your homies do this shit, homie? Put some music on, homie. I can't function with no music or nothing. Huh? So I'm just gonna go along with what they did, so we'll figure it out right now. I think this is supposed to be the power. Mark, man, look at this. It's like house electrical, house cable, too, dude. First things first, let's make a little bracket here so we can mount all the solenoids and everything. That way when he puts his cover on, it'll be blocked, but we'll be able to see everything right here for this. Got some good music going on, Carapilla. We'll put the relays right here, and then we'll just run a couple wires up to the to get power. ¿Me entiendes, Mendes? Simón, que yes, The way you want to do this is normally you could run this, but it doesn't make any sense to have this and the popper. So normally you have a pop button somewhere right here, so you can, or on the other side, the, the driver's side or here, so you can hit it with the button, then it works. You can't have, I mean, you could, you could, you could do whatever the fuck you want. I don't want to say you can't. So what we'll do just to test it out real quick, disconnect. We'll, oops, we'll disconnect this. <laughs> put Remote. Allen bolts. They got regular bolts here. This is like a metric you see. I don't even know what the hell that is. It's <laughs> that's from like a Honda or something. <laughs> see that? Without the spring it might work. Let's try it. Let's see what it does. Just hold it right there, Carpilla. Let's see if it's gonna Yeah, see it would work, see? Let go. I just need to be greased up. Let's do the window. Let's do the window. We'll come back and uh, execute the door. Let's make the windows work. Make uh, lower it up all nice, and then we'll come back to the door latches.
nothing but perfection. We're wired up. And then we just have a power wire going here. That's all we need. This is a relay for the door poppers and the relay for the car window. Keep it simple, you know what I mean? How's the little bracket doing? Bring it. Let's put it on. Come on, chop chop. Let's go. We got work to do. I'm gonna drill it right here. Where's the drill? I'm gonna use the impact on this little thing, cabron. Think about it. And then we put the grounds over here. So when we install it, all we have to do is run power to this. This is gonna go to the ignition and then we'll just run straight power over here. That's right, baby. That's right, Peachy Carapila. That's good. That's good. Don't get all fucking chupo on it, huh? Chupo. Chupo. So we made kind of like a little relay panel fuse, whatever you want to call it. We're going to mount it right here. This one goes to the door popper, this one goes to the power window, this one goes to the power inside the car. And that already has a fuse link right here, you know what I'm saying? <sighs> Fucking clean, you know what I mean? What's for lunch? Swinging back, dude. You don't know if you're going to Try it again. Go down. Oh, just gotta hook it up now. Yeah, I'm gonna use one for each side. So we're gonna run this one all the way across the fuse box.
we're gonna put the, the door popper right here because the car the truck it's it, it goes down to about here that way he'd be able to stick his foot and kick it up man pop the door open you know some og shit like that kind of pillar doesn't think it's gonna happen oh sorry yeah so how do you lock it the truck Nobody's gonna know us right here, only the owner cabron is gonna walk up to the truck like this, that way. Mira. Go like this, he's gonna look too long and then he's gonna pop the fucking door like he put this foot. I see that. Bam, oh man, and the door is gonna open and then look at it. If somebody knows where it's at, it's because you open you open your mouth. No, I'm not saying you, I'm saying like the owner. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So if the owner said, Oh, this is where I pop my my, my door, then everybody's gonna know. Right? Or they watch the YouTube video. That's what, or they watch the YouTube video. <laughs> 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> We're gonna have to blur this out. <laughs> <laughs> Two quarter twenties got a pila. Come on, big dog. Come on, papi chulo. Come on, let's do it. I think these would be better. They're a little smaller. And they're flatter. Okay. These ones right here, cabron. Give me a. Give me the one. Then give me one of the nuts. Oh yeah, they fit perfect, are not? Give me another one. on it so it doesn't get corroded since it's going to be sitting outside. I better take it easy, I might end up like Leo. You better take it easy, man, like you, Hell yeah, buddy. See this shit? That's because I had to push somebody's gums back. You need to go check the other guy, homie. There you go, man. No, loco chon, homie. Hey, you know, look what's on. Look what's on. Look what's on. Give me some I pizza. It's got to be a lot of pizza. Everybody's going to think we're all violent and shit. Hey, Jose, you want to go check that guy? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's go check that guy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's go Nothing but perfection. Nothing but perfection. It's got paint all over it, Carapilla. No it shit. Take this off and take the paint. Yeah, Look, got one more screw right here. Take all the paint off, put it on the wheel. It's got grime all over it. It's getting stuck. What the? You okay, okay? <laughs> what happened? Nada. Fucking ran it through the vent. This is the power wire for the windows, the power windows. <laughs> Easy, right. Alright, let's put this on the power over there.
What is it? Acid. Acid. Kind of acid. N neurotic. LSD. For the pulse. Once we got to the pop doors, the doors wasn't popping right, you know what I mean? But I realized why they weren't popping right, because to put the solenoid popper at an angle, it was sitting here at an angle like this, and then the rod goes up, right? So what happens when this sits at an angle, for you guys that are uh, installing door poppers, don't put the solenoid at an angle, because when you put it at an angle, it puts it's, it, it puts uh, tension on the wire when it puts and when it's sitting at an angle say you have it like this it doesn't the solenoid doesn't pop the smooth in other words it doesn't work that way it grinds it against the it, housing it grinds because it, it always keeps tension on it so what you want to do when you have your solenoid you want to have it up and down because then it, it slides smoothly so that's what was happening here because they had it sitting at an angle and right here and it sucks because they already drilled a bunch of holes they already put a hole right here and there's nothing we can do about that at this point so what i'm going to do is i'm going to move it up to where it's sitting here it was sitting here this is the four holes i'm going to move it up to where it sits straight and see how that works i'm pretty sure it's going to work properly but that's a problem you can't have it sitting like this because it creates tension like this and it doesn't go up and down smoothly once you put it up straight it, it goes up and down smooth there's no binding or nothing look this is the difference so this is the whole solenoid cut this off look does it it's supposed to be freely look it doesn't even move Look at this one. Look at this. Yeah. That'll do it, huh? That's why it's not working, bro. It's got like trash in there, but well, let's go ahead and swap it out. Yeah, whoever installed this man, they were just like on a good one, homie. Tweaking. Yeah, they were just like hitting a pipe and shit. Not that it's any bad to hit the pipe, but you know what I'm saying, right? <laughs> and you can't focus in that dude shit that he's focusing when you're hitting the pipe. Yeah, it's supposed to be like this, see that? See? No bueno. What's got a pillar? Cali, cali. Get the camera. What are you doing, Making a clean, clean, pinky ring? I got the camera spot. Huh? Alright, homie, you're good, though. I don't like the way they did this right here. You see this? They like put this right here, but it's all janky. You see that? So what we're gonna do is, uh, let's get the TIG over here. I'm gonna TIG weld it right here, make it nice. It might burn the paint, but it's still better than this, you know what I mean? Plus it looks funky, dude. Look like they put popcorn on there. Burnt the paint, but stronger now. It looks 
better. Smoke. <laughs> Ooh, that calls for one. Oh, okay. See that? You know, trigger happy. It's got some force on it. What we did is we worked on this car for about four weeks straight, right? And then we stopped because I was so sick of working on it. <laughs> and I couldn't get the, the poppers to work right. and. We went over to the other side and the power window was messed up, remember? Mm -hmm. So it feels pretty good to get this side all done and working. Let's close the door and open it up and see how it works out. Booyah! Booyah! <laughs> Booyah! That's what I like to see, you know what I mean? This side right here, everything's bad. Car window's bad, the motor's bad, so we gotta replace the motor. Pretty much replace everything that on this whole side. So hopefully we'll execute this. And we're done with this. Look at this. Look at this. Oh my god. Oh my god. Alright, fuck it. Let's put it all in. So this is the whole new uh, mechanism. Yes, sir. Right there. Mm -hmm. Come on. Thank God. Can you imagine? I have to stop everything to go to the hospital. Fuck. This weather's not helping at all. Ah. I bet there's somebody watching right now. They're like, oh fuck, man, just let me do it. All right, let's go see what we got. Let's compare it with the other one. Let's see if we can piece it together. Hmm. Whew, Tuesday. It's about 90. I know there's gonna be somebody that's gonna, 90, that ain't nothing. It's something for us, man. We live in San Diego. We got the best weather in the world. So, this is the old motor, the old one. We took the motor out, it's like completely different. So what we're gonna do is put a new one on. It looks almost the same, you see that? It's just the mounting point. Oh no, the mounting point is the same too. Holy smoke, look at that. Yeah. This is the same, huh? Exact same. Holy shit, I think we scored. But look, this is where we need to cut it. Cause usually you cut these to make them fit.
right now. Find the hole? <laughs> no, it tries to dig in. Right here, just to line that up right there. There it is. Alright, let's see. Oh, yeah. Mmm! Again, homie! Let's do this. It's starting to get super warm. We'll put in the motor, the solenoid, so we can go up and down like this and we don't have to keep doing the the battery thing. Matter of fact, let's check it Pila, see if you can find one more, loco chon. And one of them's not the right one. I said I hate to break, I hate to break the news. Huh? Did you find one? Another pila. Yeah, another one. Where? Ah, yeah. Why would you throw it? There, there. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> Why would you throw it, dog? I can't know. I can't. chinga, that's me. Why would you throw it, carapila? So you can catch it. It's a fucking little ass fucking boat. I got it. Booyah! We're taking off the gauges, we're gonna replace them. The speedo is not working and the sending unit for the gas tank is not working. So we're gonna put a new sending unit on the tank and we're gonna put up new gauges and rewire them up. Seems like a lot of shit's wrong with this car. Oh man, did I just cut? I'm trying not to cut so much. What's up, loco chon? You gotta put a cable to the training. Oh, it's, uh, no, it's uh, GPS, oh, homie. Yeah. Yeah. You like GPS? Huh? You like that? You got GPS on your car, right? Yeah. I don't know. I was thinking about maybe running it through here. Gotta be by the window. Here. 
What do you mean it's got to be by yeah, the window? Like, Who told you that? <laughs> Here, give me that plug that's right there real quick. Stop fucking around. Get to work. There's two styles of, of gauges nowadays. They have uh, the one that runs off the, the speedometer. On, I mean the transmission, I'm sorry. So you can run a speedo cable, which you call a speedo cable, and run it all the way to the top on the gauge. And it hooks up to the back of the gauge. Or there's electronic too, like an electronic cable. Cabron, I'm talking to the people right now, carnal. What's up with you? What? What? What's up? Ahí está una pluguita, like a little white, white, uh, white plug right there on top of the table. Anyways, so uh, and then there's the GPS style now. You can have like a, a GPS running, like it's a little, it's a little box. We, we'll show it right now. It's a little box that you hook, you like put it inside the car, and uh, and it reads off the satellite, homie. Technology. This is the new one. This is the the old one. They're basically the same. This black and dolphin gauges. They're pretty cool. Get the get the gasolina. Get the. These all work. The only one we need to make work is this one. So we got to put the. The sending unit from that came with this gauge kit, you know what I mean? And then this one right here, we'll just take it out. This is a, like a new one, new roll. They, the they are the same. I'm just saying I want. I, fuck, pinche carapila. Why you always gotta make me work harder, homie? Pinche carapila, away. Oh yeah, that's it right there, bro. Give me the GPS, loco. What do you mean? No, no, no. It's gotta be somewhere. Where you put your inside? Give me a rack so I can clean the inside right here. Little dip rack. Mojada. Where'd you find this at? Oh! Fucking gotta do your job, homie. This is your job. Why am I doing it, Pichu Carapila? Here, we're running through the back right here. Oh fuck, Toshi's here. What's up, Peachy Toshi? <laughs> Did you walk over here from Japan or you got on the boat? Or on the plane? You yeah. flew over here? <laughs> Condom? Protecting you. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's let's get the gas tank down. Let's. Yeah. Whoa, carapilla. It doesn't have a lot of gas. It's like three That's gallons or two, two gallons. Oh, is that how you check? Is that how you check? Is that how you do it? Is that how you do things? Just go like this and it tells you how much gas it has in there. Feels sick. It feels Get a screwdriver. A nice six in with the long extension so we can zap it from here. Hopefully it doesn't turn like into a nightmare like everything else. Who's your daddy? Who's your daddy, cabron? Did you get a nice six in? No, let's take off the boat, tell me. Or let's chop them off. You know what? Let's get a little cardboard right there so it doesn't scratch up the gas tank. Shit. Get a little plug.
carne asada. Oh. Uh. So she wants tacos. Tacos? The carne asada. Oh, she wants tacos. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> That's what you want me to do it? You're fucked up, dude. <laughs> <laughs> Just put this and assume this shit's gonna help you breathe. <laughs> How's that for? I don't know, dude. It's obviously we can't put this in the tank, right? So we're gonna make it shorter so we'll be able to put it in the tank. So what I noticed what they did here before is they shortened the wire that goes up in the thing. I've never ever done that before. So I don't know if that makes a difference. Now if there's anybody out there that know if it makes a difference, please put it in the comment area so what we're gonna do is take the measurement off the old one since it's already here give me a tape measure for favor tape measure girl don't tape measure it I'm just gonna use the parts off of this one they already got the right measurements and the size sure give me some regular pinzas cabron yeah hey, let me cut this first Three, four, five, six, and five eighths. See right there, bro. Whoever doesn't like me, let me know. Leave a whoever doesn't like me. Whoever doesn't like this, let me know. Leave a comment, and I'll see if I can fix you. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Make a little bracket to hold it right here, and we'll run the hose from here to here. I think that'll work, right? Hey, go ahead and tighten these up. I'm gonna go. Ida, you want to put this on here, or you want me to do it? You do it. You want to? You already so, dude. You already so on me. <laughs> hey, you were on my side, dog. Fucking went down my arm. Uh, sucks. You gotta love the gasoline now, man. Uh, the smell of gasoline. I don't understand these people, man. They want to turn everything electric, you know what I mean? When the smell of gasoline is so much better, right? <laughs> I think we're gonna get to drive it off the lift today. We got Toshi to help us push here. Came all the way from Japan to help us push. Ciao! That's what I'm talking about, huh, Toshi? <laughs> you just said yes! This motherfucker don't even understand what I'm saying! Alright, well, we're gonna finish. Wow, how you like me now? I'm in the mix. Got it?
Give me the hose cutter. No, I'm just going to move it out. Good. Está la puerta abierta. works, temperature works, AC works, so nice and cool, rolling with the windows up like grown men. <laughs> 